Can you believe it? We're already in week number seven with Desmond Howard. I mean, the Heisman Challenge is almost over, and we have most of the goals completed. And here's week number seven against North Carolina. season continues and we've got what should be a great game coming your way all the footage that i have so far are under the difficulty of all american and uh, i am slowly day by day you know starting to regret it because as you can see and uh you know i really have to stop saying that phrase a lot i am just going deep every play and i mean you can blame the fact that desmond howard is pretty much 99 everything that's one excuse for me you know going deep every play and getting all these catches to go down but um the fact that i have this difficulty on all american um is uh still you know coming back to me because i did want to make this a little difficult i know my team really hasn't done as uh high of what i wanted it to be you know we haven't really gotten all the wins that i wanted us to get but like as a performance wise individual performance i am just outdoing what the stat sheets are you know showing because i'm getting like four touchdowns a game five touchdowns a game six touchdowns a game and it's pretty ridiculous as of now so uh this game has been a back and forth one it's 28 to 28 right now i finally tied things up and we're gonna finally get the ball back here trying to have an opportunity to take the lead but the quarterback doesn't even look at me and he decides to take it and pass it to the left side of the field and this one gets intercepted right there so a mistake by the quarterback and that leads to north carolina getting a touchdown so we're playing uh, catch again once again um and uh we are down right here late in the third quarter i'm gonna run a hook play right here my guy is gonna go up for that one handed catch and i know i say this a lot in my videos but i love the catching animations this year i mean take a look at this one right here desmond howard going up and he comes down with one hand and he is still on his feet but they finally get him down so we run a hook play right here which is automatic for desmond howard because of that speed and then we're gonna run or should i say a slant obviously and we're gonna do another slant in the end zone which tied things up once again so north carolina we haven't been able to stop them at all they get a touchdown and i'm going deep right here with a minute remaining no one there to catch me and we are going to tie things up once again so it's 42 to 41 and uh, let's just simulate it yes we do get the extra point but obviously our defense can't buy a stop in this game and they were able to come here late in the fourth quarter and take the lead and beat us in this one so a devastating loss here in week number seven as north carolina wins this 49 to 42 but most of the games that we lost this season have been last minute. I mean, we haven't really been shut out yet. So, obviously, taking a look at Chasing Desmond individually, I have been doing pretty well. All the goals have been completed. But as a team, 4-3 and three record. And this was something that I'm really not that have You know, I didn't really expect. So, we're going to simulate into week number 8. Uh, another tough game, probably. But here's another video by Desmond Howard. I never lost to Ohio State. But it still was a huge rivalry for us. We knew what it meant. And Bo Schembechler, I was very, very blessed to play two years for Coach Bo Schembechler. And he's one of the architects <laughs> of the Michigan-Ohio State rivalry. So he made sure that he instilled in us how important that game was. And um, it was different. It was, there was no hide, hiding it. There was no uh, beating around the bush. This is a different week. This is a different team. This is going to be a different game. From that video right there, you see a lot of the rivalry moments that uh, Desmond Howard went through in his collegiate career. And taking a look at the Heisman watch, a lot of new players have been added to it. But one guy that is still up on the top is obviously me. And things haven't changed yet. So let's kick things off week number eight against the 5-2 and two Florida State team. Here come the Hurricanes. Today we look to piece together the bowl and championship pictures. Now, I by far have one of the worst lucks against FSU, uh, including Road to Glory, Dynasty Mode, and all sorts of game modes. I just have a bad luck against Florida State. So, our first possession right here, not so bad. Get two completions right there, and then a little turnaround right there. I decided to fake that one and uh, go deep because none of these coverage uh, cornerbacks 
can match up to my speed. So we go up 7 to nothing here, and then I'm lied, left open once again. Uh, as you can see, I followed a route right there, and that route takes me to the end zone once again. But we are still in the first quarter here with two seconds remaining. Third and 17. I'm going deep. And uh, 3 for 3 now in the first quarter. We got up. 21 to nothing early on but Florida State had to come back and put up a couple of touchdowns as well so it's 35 to 21 here third quarter 10 receptions so far 250 yards including those three touchdowns so a running play right here in the end zone pretty much gives us another touchdown and this right here 45 to 37 it's still one touchdown game this catch pretty much ended things for Florida State late in the game with 256 remaining they put up a fight we put up a fight but at the end it was just too much as we came up big here in week number eight after that devastating loss against North Carolina and we won that one so next up uh, there's only a couple games left so this series is almost over we are in week number three against Virginia Tech four and four record I'll see you guys next time